Hello Toy Collector fans, Universal Toy Collector here and welcome to the channel. Join me today as I pick out my top 5 6 inch Black Series 40th Anniversary Star Wars card backs. So before we start, I will say that this video has been heavily influenced by a video from Matt over at Zero Hunter Toys, where he went through certain card backs within his collection. And I thought to myself, do you know what, Matt? That is a spiffing idea. Now, other influences um, do include Only One Kenobi and Tim over at Bosk's Bounty. I know they've done um, their top five card backs and stuff like that. So what I'll be doing is picking out my top five from this line here. I will also be doing an honorary mention. Plus, I will be picking out the worst of the bunch. So let's get a close up and see what we've got to choose from. With 2017 being the 40th anniversary of the movie Star Wars, Hasbro released the 6-inch Black Series Star Wars 40th anniversary figures and card backs and there are 12 figures within this line and those 12 figures are reminiscent of the first 12 figures ever released by Kenner back in the late 70s and they consist of C-3PO, R2-D2, Stormtrooper, Darth Vader, Princess Leia Organa, the Jawa, Luke Skywalker, Tuscan Raider, or as it was known back in the day, Sand People, Ben Obi-Wan Kenobi, Chewbacca, Han Solo, and the Death Star Commander, known back then as the Death Squad Commander. Now, each and every one of these card backs is so iconic and they bring back so many nostalgic memories for me from when I was a kid. And I've got to say, I found this really, really difficult to pick a top five. Now, whether it's going to be as in like at number five, number four, number three, number two, number one, it might just be card backs that make it into my uh, top five, but in no particular order. Um, again, it was very difficult to pick a um, honourable mention card back, but I've got to say it was fairly easy to pick my least favourite of the bunch. But what I'm going to do is I'll save that to later and I'll start with my honourable mention. Righty ho then, so my honourable mention goes to Han Solo. And like I said, this video is basically all about the card backs. It's got nothing to do with the figure because the figures of 2017 were very good for their day. And I know that as times progressed, the articulation on the figures has got a lot better as to has the photo real face sculpts. So I cannot judge a figure from 2017 to today's standard of figures. It is purely to do with the card back. Now, the reason Han Solo didn't make it into my top five is simply because, and I've mentioned this before in a previous video, for me, the bubble is just that little bit too big and you cannot see his blaster on the card back, which is a real shame because if you could see the full image of Han Solo and his blaster, this card back would have definitely made it into my top five. But as is, it's an absolutely fantastic, iconic image of Harrison Ford as Han Solo. The green name pill, the green background behind the figure. I mean, this is just an absolute fantastic card back. And like I say, it has narrowly missed out on my top five. Anyhow, that is my honourable mention. Let's crack on and see who's made it into the top five. So first up then, and in no particular order, is the Sand People card back. And again, a really iconic image. I'm loving the colours of the background. It's just an awesome action pose. The green name pill and the green background behind the figure makes it pop. I never had this figure as a kid, so I never got to see this card back first hand uh, back in the day. 
but I always remember seeing images of this car back and thinking, wow, how cool would it be to have that car back and figure? So I'm really pleased that I've got this within this line. I've also got it in the TVC line as well. So again, one of my favorite um, card backs. Yeah, it, it, like I say, it's just so iconic. And uh, the, the Star Wars chase. And yeah, it, what is not to like about these card backs? They're absolutely fantastic. So this is one of the first ones within my top five. Let's crack on and see who else has made it into the top five. Next up in my top five is R2-D2. And how could this not be in the top five? Another fantastic looking card back, such an iconic image. And I believe that image was taken after the Battle of Yavin when they were having that ceremony towards the end of the film. I'm loving the contrast of the card. You've got the dark black in the corner of the card. Then you've got that bright image of R2-D2 standing there looking absolutely spiffing. The blue in the bubble again makes the figure pop as does the name pill. Like I said, how can this not be in anyone's top five? It is such a fantastic image. Um, again, it's a figure that I I had as a kid, but I never had the card back on the Star Wars chase. And it to me, it just looks absolutely superb. So that is number two in my top five. Let's see who the third figure is. The third figure then to make it into my top five card backs goes to the Jawa. Um, what can I say about this image other than it's absolutely fantastic? I am loving the contrast of colours. And to me, the contrast of colours, and it, I, I think it's really important for a car back. This It just makes it stand out so much. You've got the lightness of the rocks behind the dark brown cloaked figure of the Jawa. You've got his little black face in the hood there that you can't see with his beady little eyes peeking out. Again, just an absolutely marvellous image. So crystal clear. Taken from the film, which I think this is just before he zaps um, R2-D2. And then again, the bubble. You've got that yellow on the background, which really does make this figure stand out. Because the brown and the yellows, it, it, it kind of reminds me of Buzz Off. Those kind of colours. You've got the browns and you've got the yellows. And I just think that really stands out. And for me, this is the reason why the Jawa car back is in my top five oozing at number four as you can see the fourth car back to make it into my top five is that of princess leia organa and again just an absolutely fantastic stunning image of carrie fisher as princess leia i've always liked this car back it was a car back that i never had as a kid it was a figure that i never had as a kid but the blue in the bubble really makes the figure stand out especially because she's in all white um the image is that of the command center on yavin but again when i when i see these car backs and images and I, it just reminds me of my childhood even though i never had these car backs as a kid i used to see people that did have these car backs and i just think wow it, it just like i said before smacks star wars so much nostalgia so many memories and, you know, Carrie Fisher, what can I say? She was a stunning young lady um, within these movies. And, yeah, she for me, she's sorely missed. But, um, yeah, Princess Leia Organa there looking absolutely quality on that card back. So that is the fourth pick. Let's see who the last card back is in my top five. And the fifth and final card back within my top five goes to that of C-3PO and you cannot really get any more Star wars -y than this can you? C-3PO standing at the control console on the Death Star with that red line of the control panel just going across behind C-3PO's head and shoulders there an absolutely fantastic iconic looking card back there again the image is crystal clear no graininess to it just just an absolutely fantastic car back. And I don't know what it is about blue backgrounds and blue name pills. But this is the third blue background and name pill within my top five. Red is my colour. So it must be something about blue. But yeah, an absolutely fantastic, iconic looking image there of C-3PO. Now, as I said before, this has been really tough to pick out five car backs. Because every image is iconic. 
and they are all absolutely awesome within their own right. Now I've done my honourable mention, now it's time to pick out my least favourite of the 12 card backs that were in the Star Wars 40th Anniversary Black Series line. Righty ho then, so my least favourite card back then within the 12 goes to the Death Star Commander or Death Squad Commander. The reason being is because it's a fairly dark looking card back. Yes, his face is lit up, but the bloke's asleep. He looks like he can't be asked. I mean, you know, he's got one job to do, stand there and have a photograph taken. At least have your eyes open. It looks like you're interested in the job, doesn't it? But um, yeah, it, I, I don't know what to say about this. It's an iconic image. Absolutely. I'm loving the till background behind the character and the name pill. But other than that, it's not the greatest image in the world. And when this when this car back first came out back in the 70s, I bet that guy who plays this 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 character was like, oh, yeah, look at that. I'm fantastic. I'm going to be in a oh, bugger me. Look, I'm asleep. What the hell was that all about? Uh, he must have been so disappointed, the fella. But yeah, anyhow, that is my least favourite card back. Um, iconic an image as it is. It just doesn't float any boats for me. So uh, so yeah, that's that. So what I'm going to do is get the other figures up in front of us. Um, those that are in the top five, that is. And then I'm going to see the video out. Two seconds. Okie dokie then, so here are my top 5 6 inch Black Series 40th Anniversary Star Wars car backs and in no particular order they are R2-D2, the Tusker Raider Stroke Sand People, Princess Leia Organa, the Jawa and C-3PO. Not to forget Han Solo as my honourable mention and the Death Star Stroke Death Squad Commander as my least favourite car back. I said at the beginning of the video this was a really tough decision to make because I think they are all quality iconic card backs. But for me, these five just edged it within this line. There will be a follow up video coming at some point where I'm going through my top five six inch black series 40th anniversary Empire Strikes Back card backs. That will be followed by the six inch black series. 40th anniversary Return of the Jedi car backs as well. So those two videos will be coming at some point. Now before I end this video, I just want to say a massive, massive thank you to all those that expressed an interest of taking part in the If They Can Wish 24 hour charity live stream in aid of Give Kids the World. Now I know it's in March and there's a long way to go before then and lots can happen. But yesterday I put out feelers to gauge what the interest would be and I have to say I am very overwhelmed um, by the amount of people that said that they would be interested in taking part. That is absolutely fantastic. Um, last year we did an absolutely amazing job at raising as much awareness and money as possible within the space of 24 hours. I'm sure that there's no doubt we will be doing the same again. Um, like I said yesterday, we're just feelers to gauge um, what the interest would be. Um, I'm not going to start properly working on this until the new year. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to be working on a, um, a schedule then. But I've got to say that the support and, and the interest is absolutely phenomenal. So from the very bottom of my heart, thank you so much to each and every one of you that have expressed an interest and got back to me to say that you would like to take part. Now, as I said, I know March is a way off and lots can happen. Some people might not be able to make it. Listen, it's early days. I know things can happen. If you cannot make it, please do not feel bad or worry about it. it you know, just you expressing an interest is absolutely amazing. Um, if you can make it, then that is fantastic. If you can't, then look, it's understandable. Things happen in life, um, you know, so it, it's not an issue. But like I said, the support and the interest, mind blowing. Thank you so much. Anyhow, that is enough for me. Um, I just want to say thank you once again. Um, yeah, so all I've got left to say is if you are new to the channel, feel free to comment, like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell to let you know of more content. And as always, there will be more content.
thank you so much for watching. I do very much genuinely appreciate all your support. Stay safe, take care, and see you in the next video. Bye for now.